hey everyone welcome back to the channel hope you all are doing great so guys today i was at this traffic signal waiting for it to turn green but it just did not and i got to know the traffic has been stalled due to a vip movement there was this never ending entourage of cars passing by and i got really bored so i pulled out my cell phone and guess what there was no network on my cell phone i'm pretty sure most of you must have encountered something like that at some point guys this happened due to a signal jamming vehicle that accompanies the cavalcade and i got really curious how a vehicle with some poles attached to it could mess with all the cell phone signals so in this video i am going to tell you how cell phone jammers actually work so guys a mobile phone jammer or blocker is a device which deliberately transmits signals on the same radio frequencies as mobile phones disrupting the communication between the phone and the cell phone base station effectively disabling mobile phones within the range of the jammer preventing them from receiving signals and from transmitting them it might be hard for you to follow this process without first understanding the cell phone signals cell phones work by sending signals to cell phone towers the cell tower then receives the signal depending on the cell phone's location cell towers divide their workload by honing in on specific areas so when you travel without with your cell phone your cell phone sends signals to different towers the jamming device works by sending radio frequencies to the same tower it will overpower the cell phone signal by mimicking your cell phone basically it sends out a signal that is the same frequency as your phone this signal is powerful enough to outmuscle your phone signal the jamming device's signal and your cell phone signal eventually collide this process causes a lapse in communication between the cell phone and the cell phone tower jammers can be used in practically any location but are found primarily in places where a phone call would be particularly disruptive because silence is expected such as entertainment venues high security zones or as in my case in a vip entourage so guys next time something like this happens to you you would know exactly what's the reason behind it and hopefully will not curse the network provider hope you found the video and the topic interesting if you did please consider hitting the like button and subscribe to the channel until next time goodbye